There's nothing like a good old bow and arrow. Aside from being a deadly weapon in the right hands, it just flat out looks cool. The film is filled with master archers, but we wondered, who's the best bowman? Bow woman? Bow elf? We've taken arguably the best archers in modern movies and pitted them against each other to answer that very question. So sorry, no Robin Hood or Gina Davis here. Yes, real life Gina Davis. So who will win our arrow off? Marvel's Hawkeye, Katniss from The Hunger Games, or Lord of the Rings Legolas? Sure, we can have subjective arguments all day, like which actors took their training seriously and which spent more time working on their album. So much more than just archery. But what is objective besides who has the best hair? It's Legolas. We're talking about the skill of the actual characters. For that, we have math on our side, thanks to fandom's analytics. This is film's best archer, by the numbers. Across his movies, Hawkeye does some serious damage. Not only does he take out a helicarrier's engine, he also shoots an arrow right into a computer. He does miss Black Widow a couple of times while in his Loki-induced trance, but we can chalk that up to the power of friendship. For the complete stats, let's fire up our Film Analyzing Network Detection Algorithm, better known as Fanda, to see every shot he's ever fired. Scanning. Scanning. Analysis complete. Displaying results. Okay, Clint, we see you. Put it on the board. Clint Parton records 55 hits, 9 misses, and 22 shots where we don't know the result. Not bad for a guy with that haircut. Next up is the girl on fire herself, Katniss Everdeen. Hunting children in a dystopian nightmare future really helps your aim. Their heads are so small. <laughs> Ooh, that's dark. So if you want to get the attention of that special guy, gal, or non-binary pal, can I recommend shooting an arrow right into the apple of the pig they're eating? It'll turn you from a 10 to an 11. Thank you. Let's count up her performance across all four of the Hunger Gameses. Scanning, scanning. Wait, this movie is about children killing children? Even as a robot, I don't like this. Suck it up, Fanda. We're not paying you to develop feelings. Scanning, analysis complete. Displaying results.
Improving on our accuracy numbers with every film, Katniss hits 36, misses 6, and we don't know where one arrow lands. Odds of a hit are pretty in her favor. And now we check in with the fanciest of our archers, Legolas. For the Lord of the Rings movies, we'll be using the theatrical cuts and not the extended editions. If it wasn't on a big screen, never happened. My favorite shot from our favorite berries and cream boy? Well, that was when he murks an orc from about 600 feet away. Let's see how he does in the rest of his movies too. Scanning. Scanning. Analysis complete. Displaying results. Very impressive stuff. Let's save his final results for later and recap where we're at so far. With 55 hits, 9 misses, and 22 shots we don't see land, for an accuracy percentage of 85.9, the star of Hawkeye, Hawkeye. With 36 hits, 6 misses, and 1 shot we don't see land, for an accuracy percentage of 85.7, it's the girl on fire, Katniss Everdeen. Just 0.2 less accurate than Clint Barton. And finally, with a whopping 57 hits, a mere 2 misses, and 20 shots we don't see land, for an accuracy percentage of 96.6%, it's the hardest working elf in show business, Legolas Greenleaf. Take a bow. You earned it, you old increasingly smooth man. Maybe not the most surprising result, but who knows? With Hawkeye premiering on Disney+, Plus, Lego's days at the top could be numbered. Speaking of which, keep it taut until the next episode of By the Numbers, where we'll use even more math to answer even more silly questions.